Hi, right, this is B Bear. Uh, this is how to charging uh, this very piece of shit driver. And this bullshit driver is big problem is a charging system <sighs> because its charging station is too big and too soft. So I don't hand by. I, I, anyway, it's not charging well and very hard to handle. So now I don't have a charger now. <sighs> so I must add some charging circuit to it to this bullshit design. So I will show you how to do that. To that, at first time I try to connect to uh, directly dish power to it here. It is not work like that, so I must <laughs> disassemble the entire this system at here, and I try to add some LED, much more powerful LED at here, because this LED is uh, luminous is so soft. So <laughs> I will try to change it. Uh, is this some? Um, uh, this is a neodymium uh, magnet. So this neodymium magnet can add magnet to entire areas so I just use tape right make it make it pump it looking so bad so I must replace this too let's pause uh, this paper again uh, I resumed so this is disassembled uh, this bullshit x so shitty uh, basic grip and basic concept itself is not bad but other system was so soft, so at here you can see lithium ion battery at here. So, so right here, yes. And at here, the LED line at here. So now I tried adding some charging LED at here and replace this LED to much more bigger power than power stone. Let's pause. Yeah, I resumed. So this is <coughs> my the mobile or conventional uh, pass pass pack. So it's very shim material, but very strong and firm. Good enough handle this hard hard product. Uh, it has a lubo ceiling here. So when it lights up. It's basically waterproof, so you can pour water on this. It's the same. So all all thing come from eBay, mostly come from eBay, and the funniest thing is, every circuit already on the eBay, so you can just buy some circuit and replace it. It work well. It's. Uh, it's just the same as the changing battery at a system, so just you can you need to do is uh, just wiring something that's all you need. So and here already there's uh, uh, this battery. Uh, it's very good battery. So it's a, a new kind of a battery system. Lithium Pero P4. It have extreme strong power, so I want I think about adding this to it here. So, but but it's later. So at this time I need to just this charger tap it here. So I use really this wire, connect it and LED part to to adding the much more bright LED to add here. Uh, I will do pause. I uh, I resume this. Uh, there is uh, some parts at here to connect. Uh, make a charging system to here. I will directly connect to it, uh, this line to it here and make it in jack at here. 
So it's a, a conventional and very common DC jack, but one dipper is it has a screw type connection, so you can just put it and screw it, and it's an. I use this because it's good for past making, so I want to make it quick and pass. So I have this LED here. It will add it at here. So uh, there is so much uh, powerful LED on the market, but one big problem is it need a heat dispenser, so it getting very hot. But this one is don't don't need a heat dispenser, so I use this for the at here. Uh, this is capacitor. Uh, this is this LED console. Uh, half watt power, so it don't need a uh, heat dispenser. And this will be uh, charging system for this. Uh, it's constant current DC down circuit. So to charging a battery, it must be constant current because it. If it uh, uh, current is too high, battery itself ex explodes, really explodes, and you handle with the damage. So uh, it must be constant current. If this is not uh, blown out, the battery itself uh, damaged by high current. So you must use constant current charger. So line in here. And keep uh, keep give uh, for for that to voltage at here by this it uh, get charged. So I will make that. Oh, I I forgot something. Uh, this is a paste uh, electricity conductive paste uh, wire glue. Uh, I need this for connecting wire because. A contact area must be cleaned by some conductive stuff, so not just uh, putting on or nodding or lopping or whatever it is. So connected it heat it needs some glue like this. Instead of using lead or lead free soldering, I use a paste because it's very fast, easy, and in most cases it could you know so use some wire glue kind of like this and make it very fast. I pose. Hi right, Peter. Uh, so I finish this all. I can add add extra a uh, new uh, high power added to to this because it was voltage was deeper. Because it used yellow light uh, here, as you can see, yellow light is uh, two voltage, uh, white is three voltage. So I can use that, and I just add it here, a wire at here. It will be charged, charged by uh, put that two voltage by this, and I will be I will use a conventional PC ATX power as adapter it here because it's extremely cheap uh, it's extremely cheap and you can get access and junk yard and extremely powerful so I use it as ad adapter and charge it, charge it battery source at here thank you for watching this video and if you need any other question and still don't understand what's going on in here uh, you can write some reply right there so, uh, repeat again. Uh, this is a 20, 20 voltage adapter. Adapter right here. It goes to this charging circuit. Um, I will uh, fix voltage for that to volt, volt and three ampere. So it will charging this battery right here. You don't need the battery station. A charging station for this. Shitty design.